Hey guys, Amoth here, and welcome back to Nicholas's Weird Adventure, where we left off, this kid was still raping that poor pink elephant. Freaking kid. Kids, man. What are you gonna do? Do I gotta put you on this height or not under that? Yeah. You, uh, really don't want to go that way for some reason. You just don't, okay? I could tell someone's having a party in there. They're gonna have a party. No, I'm saying that. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna have a glass. Nope, nope, and nope. Where do I go now? Let's see if we can go down. Nope. So this is like the fountain that that tiki dude with the nice voice was saying. Alright. Let's talk to Fat Kid. Hey, Fat Kid. Hey, nice Naomi doll. I guess you're cool after all. Oh, thanks. As long as you're here, would you mind doing me a favor? I'm really hungry, but none of the restaurants around here serve Japanese food. Why don't they serve Japanese food? I think they have some. Paki at Suncoast. Would you mind getting me some? I would, but I don't really have any money. I guess I could give the money to buy it from you, but I want condition. Let me hold on to that Maromi while you buy it so I know you won't run off of my money. I want to turn Maromi to you and you give me the pocket deal. Okay. Arigato gozaimasu. Arigato gozaimasu. I know I could count on you. Dinna dinna chugga 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 choo choo. Fucking pocky. Hello, little girl. It's the magnet section. There's also some Pocky on the shop. You take it. Crap. <laughs> so you know I'm just going with hundred pack, bro. Why to buy this Pocky, please? Sure thing, that'll be two ninety nine. Here's your Pocky and here's your change. There's no need to bother this guy unless you want to buy something which you don't sell there. Oh, Pikachu. Goodbye, Pikachu. Okay, fat kid. I have your Pocky. I have your anal Pocky. Shove up your ass, you can play with it. Whatever. I don't care what you want to do with it. I brought the Pocky. Yeah, yeah, ta. Arigato again. You can have your Maromi back and feel free to keep the change. Ew, that attack was really stinky. This Maromi smells like a Dan hole now. Are they Afro and Fountain? No. What the hell did I need again? Crap. What did he say I need? Mr. Dude? Did you find all our ingredients? Not yet. Remember, you need coin, life square, big leaf, and large pair of underwear. Got it, I'll be back soon. So I need big leaf, underwear, and a live squirrel. Kid. I will use a small moment to get you off of the elephant. Ugh. Maybe I should get the little girl to come here. Who knows? Maybe she can stop that kid from raping the elephant. Hey, little girl, you want to stop that kid from raping that pink elephant? It's most like you have a dead pet too. Can I see it? Can I? Can I? Can I? Er, do you, do you mean Maromi? It, it's just just a... Oh, you're Maromi's way cuter than my dead pet. You want to trade Maromi for daddy? Sure, why not? Thanks, here you go. Take good care of daddy for me. Goodbye, honey boo boo. Son, I will give that dude daddy. I'ma break that kid out of the freaking hell. Crap. Can I use. Oh, I wonder if I can use daddy. I wonder if he, uh. Old shop dude, daddy. daddy. Feed me. Sorry, I'm not gonna feed you. Anyway. Look at that fucking daddy. You have a dead squirrel. Pets don't eat squirrels. Large pair of underwear. <clears throat> I am not. I am not stripping this fat dude apart. No, if he needs that, his underwear, hell no. Hell to the fuck no. Hmm. 
Oh, let's move some building our workshop. I regret going here. I'll call you here to test for the new square model prototype. Actually, this is a dead square. Step right this way, please. Alright, I guess I don't have any news. Oh, we're gonna make pot. We're gonna make daddy or ivy. This is the hear me station. You got your very <laughs> Oh, God. You record a custom bit of a voice box which you place into the squirrel. Alright, here it goes. Squirrel noise! Squirrel noise! Squirrel noise! Squirrel noise! Great job! Now go on and stuff your squirrel. Here we go, your friend with stuffing. And then we have a chest type. Oh, chill. The fuck meat station in here. We're giving it a shower. There we go, well, now we name it over here. There, for now it's Baron Specific. That was the worst puns I've ever heard. Oh, I apologize, it's required. I'll name the squirrel. Hey, he's naming it Ivy. This is it. Now let's go. We got some clothes for your new friend. Look, there's something I have to say. This is until it's a nudist. Okay, then proceed to the register. Ivy is a. Okay, wanna squeeze that voice box to me make sure we're all going. We're all going. Squirrel noise. It's a squirrel noise. Great. The new squirrel part of success. Thank you. Please come again. Oh, that was by far the most messed up experience I've ever had. I wish I remember how the squirrel was alive. Hey, kid. Damn it. So, to a different fountain. I have the penny. I have the ivy. Now I need. A, can I, uh. Be live to the plant. Plant. Grab. Squirrel moments. Squirrel. Hey, that store's open. Chugga chugga choo choo. Ah, oh, good sky. This is where I can the underwear. Fuck. Welcome to the Gothaholics Anonymous. Home with the stupidest store name ever. Underwear? Are you in your underwear? That must be the giant pair of undies. Undies! Be careful to be mine. Yeah, I know those are not to scare them. Shut up. Hmm. Are you gonna eat that broken mannequin? Wait, that's not right. Do you mind if I had the broken mannequin over there in the corner? Well, I actually was gonna eat it, but alright, keep it. Hey, you can't expect to lose me on the mannequin diet anyway. Are you saying I'm fat? Not if it means I don't get the mannequin. Oh, just take it already. That's, that, that's not right. You take the mannequin, you also get a large pair of undies. It's right now I need is a big leaf. Probably gonna have to feed it to Mr. Dude. Oh, that guy. Oh, little shop of horrors, dude. I'll give you the mannequin version of Rick Moranis. Munch, munch, gulp. You tasted kind of funny. Wait a minute, you found me a mannequin, don't you? I don't. Pretty funny joke, huh? No, I'm allergic to mannequins. So that, so that was all what that so. Uh -huh. So it's all Rick Moranis had to do with that movie was give him a, a mannequin. Oh, did you find all of the ingredients? Yep, I have the one right here. Excellent. Give them to me, and I mix them for you. Now hurry, take this back to Water Fountain right away. Thank you, giant witch doctor guy. I wish, I wish I had the DVD of the first season of Ghost in the Sh in the Shell standalone complex. <gasps> wow, what do you know? The DVD I wanted. I guess we should really do come true. Hey, that guy stole my wish. Well, oh, fine. I just have to walk up the escalator. Sheesh. <laughs> oh my God, that's funny. All he had to do was freaking walk up the escalators. That's so stupid. Who the hell is he gonna wish for it? Wow. Alright guys. That was a nice game, wasn't it? 
Well, it looks like we're going to have to end this here. Well, like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe, I'd appreciate it. This is Amal, signing. Wait! Whatever happened to the kid that was breaking the contract? I don't know, but Amal, signing out.